Samurai, we got an appointment come from. Don't tell me, Jeremy. Al Gore needs us to find a cure for his students. Lewis? Put him on the main screen. Right, put him on the main screen. Incoming transmission. This is the third time I'm trying to make this video tonight because I keep forgetting to say something at the beginning that I got. Ready? You see this? I'm going to be using this to measure things. It's 14. 14 and a quarter. But also, I have other things too, so. <laughs> You'll see where I'm going with this in a second. Yeah, baby. Hmm. If I'm reading the line correctly, it seems we must go to Canada. Canada Samurai? That is correct, my dear brother. You didn't say Canada. But why Canada? I'll explain later. To the TARDIS! Why we in Canada? We must talk to Cryptic Cowboy and Detective Doug. The Detective Doug. He was a famous detective. He lost his career from alcohol abuse due to a tragic case that flowers. I mean, it, these flowers smell nice. Jeremy, get away from those. It's the devil's lettuce. Nothing to lose in 
sense of never miss meaningless nouns. Turn on, tune in, turn your eyes around. We look at yourself, we look at yourself, we young girl. Look at yourself, we look at yourself, we young girl. Yeah. I think I sound gone. Just stick to the game plan, Jeremy. These flowers smell like my eyes. What are you doing, Jeremy? When you're a little kid, you're a little bit of everything. Artist, scientist, athlete, scholar. Sometimes it seems like growing up is a process of giving those things up, one by one. I guess we all have one thing we regret giving up. One thing we really miss. That we gave up because we were too lazy. Or we couldn't stick it out. Or because we were afraid. Snap out of it. Ten years ago, a crack commando unit was sent to prison by a military court for a crime they didn't commit. Duke, there's the cryptic cowboy. Look, Samurai. Look, just as I figured. Canadian, full tide, zombie. Will they eat our plane? Not as long as they got beer. And speaking of beer, there's the cryptic cowboy. Holy shit! But who is that someone? Alice Cooper. I'm not worthy. I'm not worthy. I'm not worthy. My What will we do? That sounds cool. I want you, Samurai. Fear not, my dear brother, for I have a plan. Will this plan be better than the last one? In order for me to fit in and not draw any unwanted attention, seems I will need a disguise. But a clever disguise. Samurai, snap out of it. Why on earth are you doing, Samurai? This is not helping at all. You have any better ideas, Jeremy? Yes, I do, Samurai. Well, I would like to hear them. Don't sniff the flowers, Samurai. Oh, 
Though I can't dismiss the memory of who kiss I know it's not for me. Quick, Jeremy! Run into the house! But won't quit the cowboy get mad at us? There's no time to ask him. Besides... Besides, he seems a bit busy right now anyways. Give me my fucking beard back, you undead foul beast! Looks like the Canadian Poolside Zombies are on the power play. Then the signs am I? It's time for, for the ice mint. Okay. Let's see what you got. I saw the zombie, but he still lives. Jeremy, these are Canadian zombies. These are not American zombies. A bullet to the head will not work. A bullet to the head won't kill them, but a puck to the head will. Where are the Philadelphia Flyers and the Mighty Ducks? We need them. Nice try, Jeremy. Maestro, some power play music, if you please. At ease, Mankins. You just got to know. How to handle the situation, Jeremy. Being prepared is only part of the... Samurai, why is that light? What light? That bright light in the sky. Like a fire in the sky. Hmm. This is disturbing. When you wish upon a star, makes no difference who you are. Goodbye, Debunker. I hope the aliens don't take you too far from me. I didn't expect that in Spanish equalization, what will Samurai say? I better get out the case and quick. Slappy, aliens took my brother. What should I do? <laughs> hey, Jeremy, you see that axe? Send things, Zappy. We got a lot of chopping to do. I 
hope you're ready to do some jobbing, kiddo. Yo, I understand, Slappy. <laughs> Thanks, Zappy. But how does this help my brother? It doesn't, but it sure helps me out. Now get the hell out of here before I call the cops. <laughs> Now, Jeremy, since, since my untimely departure, did you find any clues? What's that, Samai? It appears to be a clue. What kind of clue? A fascinating one. But what is it, Samai? I see this before. It would seem, dear brother, that we have found the grave marker. Randy. Randy the lion horse. That is correct. Randy the wild horse. Goodbye, dear Randy. advise you to go to Earth. Jody, is your dad speaking, man? I don't think you should go to Earth. Then again, you're in decent company with Crypto Cowboy uh, and his friends. I don't know about the Rob Prices. I don't know what happened to that bloke. He was there and then he was gone. If the UK had a nuclear ship and it sank, you'd ex you know, you'd expect, you know, some sort of, you know, waste management cleanup, wouldn't you? I mean, you got nuclear power in the water and you've got fish. You know, you got, you got, you know, fish are being exposed to radioactivity, you know. But no, the US government are saying, no, when these nuclear ships sink, that's it, they're just left, you know. There's nuclear activity, there's nuclear power in the ships. It's still there. And, uh... Yeah. Rather mysterious, I would say. The sort's going on down the Reba, they got an orange king, they do. You don't want to go there, son. Oh, I'm telling you. You won't get your lima beans. Rather mysterious, I would say. We must get the answer from the one, the only, Jeremy. Son, go see Jeremy, yes, because his name is close to yours. Jeremy, I'll be right back. Where are you going, Samai? I need to use the little boy's room. One, the only, Jeremy. Yes, my name is Jeremy. It's, it's nice to meet you, Jeremy. I don't know about the wrong prices. I don't know what happened to that bloke. What is a P on Daniel? It being alone. No. That's what my brother told me. Rather mysterious, I would say. So my brother took over the auntie, and now everybody is dead. But me and my brother. Travis is alive, but he don't help much. Whatever. I wonder how, I wonder why. Yesterday you told me about the blue, blue 
Hey Jimmy, I have a question to ask. Does Greens keep telling me to bad things? Is that a good thing? Yes. 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 Jimmy, should I tell my brother that I met you? No. No, 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 no. I guess he will get mad. Well, maybe. Uh, 60 40 then? Where are they going now, Jerry? My brother always needs my help. Goodbye, Space Brother. Who are you talking to, Jerry? The great Jerry. Like. The Great Kazoo? That's right, Simon. And only you can see or hear him. Would that be correct? Correct, Simon. Hogwash! I have no time for pigments of your imagination. Now let me hear no more of the Great Jerry. You got me all worked up, Jeremy! It sure is hot in Canada. All this special agent work sure gets a guy thirsty. Doing this am I? Is sweet thirsty. But not taste. This does taste odd. Where did you get this, Jeremy? The green said the gremlin. Help me to make the green. Wait a minute. Did you say ghoulies and gremlins? That is correct, my brother. What did you put in it? All natural ingredients, Samurai. Hmm. All natural, you say? We use them flowers. Flowers? Awesome. Good sense, innocent, crippled mankind. Dead kings, many things I can't define. Vocations, persuasions, blood in your mind. Sense of temperament, the colors of time. Who cares what games we choose? The little to win, but nothing to lose. In sense of temperament, meaningless nouns. Turn on, tune in, turn your eyes around. We look at yourself, we look at yourself. that we can all share before we can like others we must first like ourselves see you next week Shazam! Why aren't we driving a car? I don't know. But why about Jeremy, I'm trying to drive. But how? I don't have time for garbage. Just throw it out the window, Jeremy. This 
just another fine mess you guys need to survive. The 9000 series is the most reliable computer ever made. No 9000 computer has ever made a mistake or distorted information. I got the samurai. But first, a word from our sponsors. Hello, boys and ghouls. Do you have toys in your reho? Like this Frankenstein figure. Please put on your 3D glasses now. You must go see Lewis. Loss has the touch. Well, ill versus special touch. Freaky, I need a wee huh? Generally, there's only one that can help. Who can help? You almost always go see Lewis. This is before. This is now. It's so weird looking. This is Frankenstein wishing you a very happy Halloween. We all. Oh my god. That's a great job, Lewis. Big Zoom. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a treat. Delicious things to eat. The popcorn can't be beat. The sparkling drinks are just dandy. The chocolate bars and the candy. So let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a treat. Let's all go to the lobby to get ourselves a treat. We return you now to your regularly scheduled program. Semi good. Then you have fun, it's bad. Oh, good lord. No! I can't go through this again. Jeremy. Jeremy. We got Jeremy, if I don't make it after this, you will be the head of the family. The strength of the family, like the strength of an army, allies and their loyalty to each other. A summer day, and that day may never come, I will call upon you to do a service upon me. That's all, folks. Where are the Tracy Smothers when you need them? I'm gonna make these aliens. And I thought they kinda refuse. Good night, Semi. Samurai keeps having his own adventure. Oh no. 
looks like zombies on all around me. What the samurai thing? Jeremy, these are Canadian zombies. Shoot him in the head, Jeremy! Shoot him in the head! I will make semi quack. After countless hours of my rights being seriously violated and unnecessary alien hunting, those are three words that should never be said. I have returned. And just in time, it seems. Is this the start of another commercial? Ladies and gentlemen, now a word from our sponsors. Against Semi? Do you want to pay the bills? No, Semi. Well then. Oh, yes. Now a word from our sponsors. Or someone pretending to be our sponsor. Hey, wait a minute. Jeremy. I wonder if Jack Benny ever had days like this. Just throw the tape, Jeremy. What tape? Jeremy! Jeremy, I want a word with you. Greetings and salutations, everyone. I want to thank you for watching Cryptic Cowboy's YouTube channel. It's one of our favorites. He is not only a cool guy, he's someone we love very much. He's our friend. We want you to support his channel. Why, you ask? Um, did I mention he's a cool guy? His content is fresh and unique. He's in the great province of Ontario, which is still part of the sovereign nation called Canada. We are in the West Coast. You know, over by the Pacific over there. And now a quick word from our sponsor, Jackson Guitars. This is a Jackson Pro Shop guitar. It's a six-string electric. It has active pickups made by EMG. And you can't really hear it through this system. But trust me, sometimes you hear it on our soundtracks of our videos. Now, we must bid you adieu. But remember... Please, please, please support Cryptic Cowboy. He's a fellow Canadian, and we love him, and we're proud of him. And you should be too. Your family pets will thank you, and maybe even your spouse. Arriba We return you now to your regularly scheduled program. The official drink of the R-Team. We seem to have another problem at hand. Look! More Canadian full-size zombies! We need a way out of this. Quick, Jeremy! Throw the zombies a beer! But I don't have any beer, semi. Jeremy? Hold on, semi. What 
are you doing? I'm killing zombies. No. No, you are not. But Samurai, you said if we destroy the plane, it would die. Well, it ain't working, Jerry. You mean the movie line? Silence! Samurai, look. Tell me to Betty. Hmm. Uh -huh. Woohoo! Those must be the ghouls that Jeremy was talking about. That must be the gremlin. Strange looking fellers. Strange looking fellows. I wonder what Boris Connor would do in a situation like this. Anyways, back to the task at hand. Kojak do. Oh. Love you, baby. Samurai, while you were gone, we got a call from the UN. Don't tell me, Jeremy. Another alien race has landed. And they are sending over one of their representatives. As always, correct, Simon. Another UFO has slept and just a few blocks away. Okay. Look, Simon. Ladies and gentlemen of the earth, we greet you in peace and friendship. We come from a planet far beyond this galaxy, a planet far more developed than earth, but we come as friends. Although we know your language, our own methods of communication are mental rather than verbal. Hence, the voice you hear me speaking with is totally mechanical. Our intentions are honorable. We desire above all things to help the people of Earth, to establish embassies here, and in the near future to set up reciprocal visits between Earth people and Canamids. Now stand aside, dear brother. Allow a respected member of the UN to speak to this Canamid. But Samurai, you're not a member of the UN. Silence! I, I will speak to this Christopher Columbus from another galaxy in another time. Can you please inform us? Can you please inform us precisely why you have chosen this planet for your visit? Earth has been plagued by both natural and unnatural catastrophes all of which could easily be acted upon and prevented. We are here to help you. What do you want with us? Only that you simply trust us. The aliens left this book behind. Hmm. I wonder what it says. Use your decoding skills, Jeremy. Let me see, Samurai. Uh, try and hurry. You can't, Samurai. It will take time. Time is something we don't have much of. Humanity itself is counting on us.
I crack the tile, it says to the men. Well, maybe. Just maybe. These aliens are not so bad after all. Not like those other ones. Those aliens. I don't know, Samurai. Jeremy, you can't judge a book by its cover. Now, on with the task at hand. What is the task? Just follow the script, Jeremy. What script? I'll be right back, Jeremy. Where are you going, Samurai? I'm going to the spaceship. I need to see some answers. I don't know, Samurai. Stand aside the opportunity to spread peaceful coexistence throughout the galaxy. Stand aside, Jeremy. But, Samurai. I have a diplomatic visa. This is flight number 914 from Earth to our planet. We will be taking off in three minutes. Samurai! Samurai! Don't get on that soon. The rest of the book. To soon, man. It's a cookbook. Had a wealthy fella personality. Astronauts to the moon. <laughs> Eyes open. Cameras ready. Over and out. <laughs>